Hi everybody and welcome to this edition of Burlesque Vlog. Uh, today I'm going to be giving you my take about how I get my face ready for a show performance. This film was shot before my performance of Medusa at the London Fetish Fair. I think the way every burlesque girl does her own makeup is different. I know everyone uses different products, everybody's got a different ritual. What essentially you've seen there is, even though I am ridiculously pale, I'm making sure that everything matches. I don't wear foundation, I've never seen a need for it as I'm usually pale enough. I've met a lot of makeup artists in my time and I don't claim to know what I'm doing at all. But recently I've learned that the best way to define my cheekbones was doing exactly what you saw there. I'm using my finger to put the blusher along the cheek instead of just putting it everywhere with a brush. And I think it does give a more defined look. Speaking of defining, there's me drawing my eyebrows back in. Yeah, I am blonde. Not naturally, as you can probably tell by the hideous roots. It's real life, guys. <laughs> I, I do always make sure that I draw my eyebrows back on. All I'm using there is just a really basic eyeshadow. I'm not doing anything special. I've got an eyeshadow brush there and I'm just drawing along the natural line of my eyebrows just to give them that kind of defined 40s look. I'm starting with a base coat of quite a light green eyeshadow on the eye there. And there's a lot of me going to be farting around my makeup drawer there, which you can see. And I've usually lost something. That looks about right. So, oh, there we go. It's, it's all making sense. And what I've done is I used a little bit of yellow eyeshadow in right in the corner of the eyes because what we're going for from the juicer is more of a snake-like look, so I'm playing with that. Also, forgive me, I've never done a makeup tutorial before and I didn't think about the fact that I would be holding the mirror in front of my face. I've also just defined along the actual eye socket line there with a darker green. And here we come to the most difficult bit. This is what everybody hates is liquid eyeliner and I often get a lot of people asking me what I use, how I've learnt and the answer is just practice. I, I've been wearing my makeup like this for, for years now and this all it is is just really simple. I think it's Boots own brand uh, liquid eyeliner and all I do is outline just along the edge of the eye first and I always do my flicks last because I think that's easier. And you can make them as defined or as big as you want to with other acts I will make them a lot bigger and a lot bolder but for this one I knew that I wasn't gonna have to do too much and that's usually the best way to get it to dry and we all make mistakes as I very rightly done there and just tidying it up with a cotton bud the reason I grimaced is because I found a cotton bud that I've been gluing rhinestones on with and tried to use it on my face not a good idea nose lovely to leave that in and copious amounts of mascara now and you are basically done obviously for the stage I would usually wear a lot more glitter and some false eyelashes but just putting a little bit of mascara on so I'm, I'm gig ready I'm ready to walk out the door and then all I've got to do when I get to the venue is just do my lips put the glitter on put the lashes on and I'm ready to go on the stage and that is a very simple face there. Sometimes it can be completely different, but as you can see, done. 